on the last episode of VFL West Ham. Nagao, draw me like one of your French girls. What's up guys, it's Nagato and in today's video we've got the second episode of West Ham season 24 and we're going to play today against VFL Man United. As you can see on the screen we've already got it started off. Today we need to make sure we get the, both the wins and let's see how we do. That was a couple of years ago And now I'm revving up for the never and switching up Gears got a couple of years to go Here we go As soon as you hear that go Liverpool to Portsmouth Yeah, that chorus got the crowd screaming This is how we need to start games off with a bang and now they're gonna have an attack but we're gonna make sure we stop it really isn't how we wanted to start this game off we wanted to make sure that we could like get a couple of girls goals in early in the game but there they were able to get a fucking goal and now they're on the attack yet again they get a through ball down our left hand side way too easily gets it in gets blocked gets saved again gets blocked by set that was some great defending there but it shouldn't be something that we have again, to do against Man United are on the attack. We're trying to get the ball back. We need to and I'm able to do that. I get it, the ball towards Nelly. Nelly finds a wonderful ball towards Trump. Trump gets it past the GK and puts it hey, in Trump. so well. Well done. the ball here he plays it towards me i play it towards nelly nelly has the ball he gets intercepted i try and get it back but i'm able to miss my fucking tackle they get a through ball yet again down our wing and he's able to cross it in he finds a head and what a save by seven ultras united have a corner here seven's gonna come out and ollie's able to make sure that that ball doesn't get to the back of the net Kick. We're going to try a cheeky little tactic where we're going to oh, pass yeah, it I'm towards the ball and then play it out wide. Ali's going to put it in. One of the defenders hits it. I don't know who that was, but I think that was Jawad who hit the post. It was unlucky. Now they're on the counter and they're completely through. I need to make sure that I don't give away red hit. And I'm able to do that. Blaze is able to find seven. Seven clears it away out of danger. There wasn't any clear chances until we get to this bit where Trump has the ball. He plays it towards Slave. Slave is pretty much one on one, but he's going to wait well, for Nelly. For he passes it to Nelly. Nelly gets it to Trump. He should have shot straight away. And too much turning, and we didn't get a shot in. And they easily, they were easily able to pass. Oh, Slave has the ball here. He passes it to Oli. Oli's trying to find a pass, and he gives it away way too cheaply. They get another through ball in. He's one on one. Seven needs to make a save, and he does. They pretty much fuck up, and the ball's still alive, but TJ's able away. to clear it away. Ball here. They're gonna get it out wide towards their players, and another through ball goes in. Sense oh, able to get a slight tackling, and. Gives oh. away a penalty. It didn't look like a penalty, but I don't think we should still be slight tackling. We need to go, go for a tackle anyway. Now they have a penalty here. It's all up to seven to make sure that he can maybe get us to save and save our lives. And he does it. <laughs> That's the first time actually I've seen someone use a start up penalty in VFL. That's a trait that people don't really play on. Just stroke to the bottom right hand corner. Call this for get worse but Scott Rennie passes it back they get it to the back post and he takes a shot and what a fucking goal man that was probably my own fault because I didn't even bother to fucking mark the guy when he went towards the back post and we are losing in the 19th minute it's unbelievable yeah he can probably get us a fucking draw because that's all we really need right now and Duncan's able to put it into the back of the net and we get a draw. I'm not really that happy about it because 
this is the kind of team we should have been being anyway. The huge disappointment of us losing to Manchester United, we're going to try and make sure what we were supposed to do from the beginning was to win both the games, but now we have to win one of the games, which is Birmingham. And let's see how well we do against them. Kick here, he's been able to get an assist last game with that, and can he do it again? Yes, he can. What a fucking goal that was by Slamik the Big Doopy. And yeah, <laughs> we get the first goal. Let's see if we don't fuck it up. But now, at the 18th minute, we're able to press Birmingham right now. Slave gets the ball towards Nelly, but he gets intercepted. But Duncan's okay. able to find the ball again. He takes the middle. Slave has it here. He turns, he shoots, and it goes in. What a goal. He gets the ball straight away, he shoots straight away, and that's how we were able to score. Nelly's able to win the ball here, gets it towards Slave. Slave finds a through ball towards Trump. Trump has the key part. Can he do it? No, he can't. Now the ball here is won by the beast known as TJ. He gets it to Nelly. Nelly takes a shot and he hits the post. So unlucky. That was a great chance for us to score, and it was unfortunate for Nelly that he couldn't get it in. Now, TJ, being the kind person he is, was able to give me the second half of this game because I couldn't get it. Slave here is one on one, gets a shot, and Waggy's able to make a great save here. We got a corner here, and we play it short. We hit it to the back post, head it back in. What a save by Waggy! What a save by Waggy. What the fuck? Who is this GK man? He's making some sick saves. Pass it short yet again. Now we aim for the back post. Sent is there, heads it down. Trump's there, and what a block by Birmingham City. Now that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you leave a like and comment wherever you think. And yeah, thanks for watching.